Good morning everyone, it is 6.02, I was just getting ready for work. It's coffee time. Hope you have a wonderful Thursday. So where am I supposed to sit? Hmm? Where am I supposed to sit? You've got my space. You've stretched through the two sides. Where am I supposed to sit? Where am I supposed to sit? My two kids are ready. It's 9.20. Picking up yearbooks. Busy street today. We got the water company out there. We've got a digger truck. Oh, water company left. It was just a big van right outside. There's another van over there. Don't know if they're going to be digging up the street. They're checking spigots. Hmm. Interesting. Right, Luna? Right, Luna, I'm going to have to budge you. You have to budge up one way or the other. Okay, I did my bi-weekly shop with Sam's. I was going to go to Costco, then I'm like, no, Sam's, because it had more of what I wanted. They didn't have over half of what I wanted, so what a shame. I was looking forward to it. But anyway, I've got a roast chicken for dinner because I'm alone tonight. Pete's going right after work to meet up with a friend. Ashley is no doubt going to Queen's because she gets off at four, but... They are saying we're supposed to get some really nasty storms. The winds are picking up now. It's supposed to start this afternoon. I don't know how long they're supposed to last or even if they'll be bad. I'm done about eight, seven, eight books already. Um, sold one and handed out some pre-orders. Uh, I've had a couple of uh, mums that are just finding out that Pete and I are not gonna be back at the school this year. And they're wondering why they had, they were wondering why they hadn't heard um, about senior portraits yet so from what I understood they do have a photographer but I don't know if he's how they're gonna get the word out to the school uh, out to the students that need to make their appointments we've had quite a few calls of kids trying to make appointments and asking when we're starting so the word is only just starting to make it to people um, but yeah I know I have to keep going over the same thing as to why but Anyway, that's that. I've got the back door open, like I said, because it's very windy, so I was able to turn the AC off, even though I'm still really warm in the house. But the fan's on me, and uh, Luna's laying in the kitchen. I'm just going to have some lunch and see how many more people come yeah, So we're getting quite a few through, through today, which is good, picking up books. Luna's become quite the hit with everybody, because she sticks her head around the door. Um, on this side of the gate and everybody's like can I pet her or is she vicious I said no you can pet her um, I don't know who this number is I don't know who that number is that number's called a few times and they never leave a message obviously they're not in my contacts um, apart from that not much going on it is dark um, we are definitely going to get the storms I don't know if you can really tell I've got no lights on but it's dark the blinds are open um, and the wind keeps picking up, so at least it's a lot cooler at the moment, so I'll take it. Now, Pete was supposed to be helping someone with their boat after work. I'm sure he's still going to go, but I don't know if they'll be doing much work on the boat. Because I don't think you'd want to be... This number needs to leave a message. It's like a cell phone number, so I have a feeling it's one of those fake numbers, because it's very similar to uh, our number. All my friends are in my thing book, so I don't know. Oh, they've left a voicemail. Let's see. Message said, sorry, Mr. Cole, call me back, please. Doesn't say who he is, doesn't say who I am. So it's definitely somebody trying to get you to call so they can hook you. No idea. So I've just blocked them anyway. All right, guys. That's it. It's getting darker and darker by the minute. I don't know where Luna went. She's either behind the chair. She likes to go behind the recliner and sleep. Or she's in the kitchen because I've got the back door open. Uh, hopefully she's all right. I realized <laughs> I have my Taste Me Simple virtual conference. I don't know if you remember me doing it last year. Um, it is live as well. You could go, but I, I chose virtual. And um, I can sign in at quarter to five and see what the new line is for fall and winter. This is my favorite changeover to fall and winter. So I'm very excited to see what they're coming out with. 
One we know is the um, creme brulee bars because they actually released those early for people to buy. So um, as of Monday, I'll be able to order any of this stuff that they revealed tonight. So I'm looking forward to that. Even though I must say my voice is gone and I'm very tired. <laughs> And this weather doesn't help, but uh, I think I'm going to go make a cup of coffee, to be honest. Okay, the door may be quiet for a little bit. Oh, look, just so you know, Wolfie has made it back onto the car. See the sticker next to the GB, and then I got the British one on the other side. Oh, we're still recording. Okay, seeing as we're still recording, it's coffee time. I need one. We're having a plain old, it's a light roast though, bowl and basket breakfast blend. This is my favorite blend because it's light. So that's what we're doing. And it is three, can't see, 311. And it's not ready yet, hurry up. Okay, seems like everything's lightening up a bit. Anyway, Peter's coming home, they're not doing the boat thing. He may go over there later on. Asha's come in, got changed, took Luna out and she's gone. So I have the conference that starts in three, three minutes. Where is Luna? She may have gone in the kitchen. Um, so yeah, I'd like to, if Pete is coming home, then I'm gonna lug all my stuff upstairs and um, I'm going to put the books away and everything now. I was just going to stay down here if he wasn't coming home and do everything from down here. So that way Luna had more of a place to run around and lay down and what have you. But if he's coming, I'm going to take advantage of the fact that I can go up and sit upstairs and actually concentrate on what's being said instead of running around at Luna Bella. Right, so let me start putting everything away anyway. I've had quite a few calls since I last spoke to you. People coming tomorrow to pick up the book. So that's all good. Had a few more people come, even in the pouring rain. So you just never know. Anyway, guys, I'm going to uh, love and leave you for a bit. And yeah, talk you I have to watch it up here anyway. They've just got people dancing in their homes or hotel rooms or whatever. Oh, these are all the virtual people, I'm assuming. But anyway, I don't even know. My ticket's in my bag. I... Um, I just got it open after 15 minutes, so at least I haven't missed anything yet. But it's good P2. It only goes for a couple of hours tonight and then tomorrow, the stuff, so on and so forth. I just couldn't get it to open. Nothing was opening. I was getting quite frustrated, brought up a sweat. Anyway, guys, I'm going to love and leave you for this evening. I hope everyone had a brilliant, brilliant um, Thursday, whatever it is you did today. Hope it was a good one. We'll definitely see you tomorrow. Take care, guys, and stay safe.